everyone and welcome to Miss Creative 47 YouTube channel. I just thought I'll come here, come on here and give you a little tutorial on how you can add words to this word banner here and you can get that same curve that you see that your banner has. So let's get started. I already did one for you just to show you idea what I was talking about. So now I'm getting ready to do this one here. So I thought I typed in a word but I guess I must have deleted so I'll just type in something else so I go to my text tool and I click off the page and I just type in something I'm going to just type in hello sunshine okay so now I'm going to I'm not going to worry about the color I'm going to get my move tool back I'm not going to worry about the color too much because I'm going to change it to black. So what I want to do is I want to put my word right on top of the banner and I'm going to double click on it and you're going to see this green box with this little green tab here but this is what we're going to focus on this little white button here that has the arrows going four ways so you're going to left click on your mouse and hold that down and this is going to allow you to move that word you see how it's curving with the banner? That's what you want. Now I'm getting ready to say, I figure this is decent. I like that right there. So I'm going to let it go. And I'm going to come over here to the left where you see this button here. It has a square with a circle on the edge of it. You're going to click on that. And you're going to click down here with a compound path. You're going to click release because it's going to release that sunshine, hello sunshine, from your image right here. Now, what it did also did was it closed up the space in between that has an opening. So what we're going to do is go up to object before we click off of it, and we're going to make it a compound path. Now it opens that back up. Now this is when you can close that out, and you can change the color by going to your field panel, and I'm going to change it to black. And I want, also want to change the outline, which you see is red around your letters. And I'm just going to click that black as well. Now I can close out that. Now my Hello Sunshine is not attached to my banner. And I can just put it here. And now you can see the flow of it is just like what's up here. And that's how you able to uh, put your words in the same direction, in the same a flow of your banner. So I hope you learned something today. Have a great weekend. Until then, I'll see you in my next video. Oh, also, if you want to just make sure they don't move and it just stay where it's at, you just, let's move this over just a little bit. And you can just group it all together. Go up to right here where it says group select shape. Or I think also you can do, um, right click on it and you can say group and it will group all all the shapes together and you can move it all at one time so like i said until then i'll see you in my next video bye